Welcome to YNU 540, coming to you from the campus of Yokohama National University, here in Yokohama, Japan's second city. My name is Alec Macaulay. This is a broadcast for English language learners here in Japan and overseas. On the show, guests come in and talk about five photos that are important to them. Denise from Germany is here today. She's an exchange student on the Joy program here at YNU. Hello, Denise. Hello. Tell me about photo number one. Photo number one, you can see two friends of my karate club, and it's in front of a hall from the graduation ceremony from the YMU students. And what's very important for me about this picture is that all the club members were waiting outside for the older people, for the students who graduated, mm -hmm. and yeah, give them presents and say congratulations. And it's very funny because we made this karate picture with a girl in kimono. Right. Very pretty. <laughs> And how long have you been doing karate? Uh, actually, I started in Germany when I was six, but I uh, came here to Japan and entered the club maybe a few months ago. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And how has your experience in the YNU Karate Club been? Oh, actually, it's fun because I didn't tell them that I've done karate for so many times, from so many years before. But uh, yeah, they're very kind to me and explain everything. It's mm -hmm. nice to be with them. Yeah. Are you learning new things here? Yeah, of course, because not a style of karate. Mm -hmm. So it's, I have to learn new things. And yeah. Have you done competitions here yeah. in Japan? <laughs> yeah, one in Tokyo. Maybe two weeks ago, I was the only foreigner, so mm -hmm. <laughs> it was fun. Yeah. Yeah, but I have nothing to lose, just to try. How but did you get on? Um, we didn't get so far, but uh, the first, first fight I won, but yeah. That was it. <laughs> Not more. <laughs> okay, thanks. And photo number two? Um, photo number two, it's uh, in the Shinjuku Kyoen. So I was going around for the hanami and mm -hmm. make pictures of cherry blossom. But uh, after a few days, I decided not to make any more pictures of cherry blossom. I wanted yeah. to make pictures of the Japanese. Mm -hmm. Because uh, it's very funny how they're walking around with the. Uh, big cameras and <laughs> making picture of everything and, and tripods too yeah, mm. yeah they make pictures of everything and <laughs> very funny it was so much fun for me to see that and take out their cell phone and make pictures and yeah you have cell phones and you have very sophisticated cameras there as well yeah that's true mm -hmm. i'm very lucky about my japanese cell phone so mm. <laughs> can make good good pictures did you get some nice pictures of the cherry blossoms yeah i got nice pictures a lot of nice pictures maybe too much mm -hmm. but that's what i switched why i switched to another picture to make pictures of the japanese people right so it's much more fun at the end so mm -hmm. <laughs> and are cherry blossoms a big thing in germany uh no it's not a big thing big thing but uh we know that's a big thing in japan mm -hmm. so we try to travel around and to see it here in Japan mm -hmm. because it's everywhere and right. looks very nice and yeah you can see the Japanese people they have it every year but they're still fascinated about it and go around so mm. it's a nice time yeah it's a nice event okay photo number three photo number three uh, it's uh, an ice rink uh -huh. it was in December last year uh, and I really like ice skating and I was so happy to find an ice rink near the red brick warehouse. Now it's a temporary one, right? They put up just for the holiday season. Yeah, right, they? right. Mm -hmm. So they just prepared it and made up light up and some music and you could go around there. It was very, very nice. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So have you been skating since you were a child? Oh, no, not since I'm a child, but uh, I'm living next to an ice rink in my hometown. So okay. Maybe during high school, I was going there every day in, during mm -hmm. winter time. So I was really happy to find something like this in Yokohama and with a nice background of the landmark tower. So mm -hmm. it's a nice feeling to go there at, in, at night. Right, right. I mean, yeah, Minato Mirai is a very nice place at yeah. Christmas. It, they light it up and decorate it yeah. very well. You know? It's fun. Have you been to other ice rinks in Yokohama? Oh, no, only this one. Right. So okay. And now who did you go with? <laughs> Who did you go to the ice rink with? Uh, with some Chinese students because they've never tried mm -hmm. and I told them that there's an ice rink so we went together and I tried to teach them mm -hmm. <laughs> how to go ice skating. Yeah, and after one hour they, was not, they were not scared anymore. Oh, so. you could pick <laughs> it up, yeah? Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. And we'll move on to your next photo. Yeah. Um, that's in a, a, how to say, a hallway you can play several sports. Like, ah, like, uh, is this JJ Club? 
Yeah, something, something like that. Yeah. Right. And I've never been to something like this before. I came to Japan, and it's, mm -hmm. I think it's very popular. It's in Ueno in Tokyo. Oh, okay. And I went there with some friends to, yeah, to play different games, mm -hmm. and it's not that expensive. I, I expect it is more expensive because so many people waste money in pachinko halls, like casino right. or something. But it's actually very funny because I've never played baseball or something before, so I just tried it like a computer game. Mm -hmm. And you can see how the, the screen in front of it and the ball comes out. You just try to oh, hit it. So that's a, that's so a, a, a virtual pitcher who's pitching yeah, at you. Yeah, yeah, right. So it was much fun for me. Mm -hmm. Tried it the first time there. Yeah. <laughs> good, well, good why time. did you go all the way to Ueno? Because we have one of these quite near this campus. Yeah, because uh, one of my uh, Japanese friends lives in Ueno. Okay. He went to my home university in Germany before and now he graduated and mm -hmm. lives in Ueno. So sometimes I visit him and we go around there and he takes me to some place like this. Right. Yeah. So what other things did you do apart from the, the baseball? Uh, I don't know how they call it, but like dart and mm -hmm. some with little pucks on the table. Ah, uh, like the air hockey? Yeah, yeah, something yeah. like that. So it was fun. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And your last photo? Uh, my last photo, it's uh, Yokohama too, mm -hmm. near the red brick house. And it's a Yokohama Oktoberfest. So okay. the Oktoberfest originally is a festival in Germany. Right. So most foreigners know about it as a drinking festival, mm -hmm. eating sausage, and yeah, drink a lot of beer. Uh, and I went there the first week when I arrived in Japan mm -hmm. because we were on a walking <laughs> tour, and they showed us around. Uh, and I wanted to go there because actually I've never been to the real festival in Germany. Right. <laughs> yeah, a lot of Japanese friends were laughing about that because because they couldn't understand why I don't... Oh, you're German. You must have been to Oktoberfest. Yeah, yeah, like yes. yeah, it must be there. So, yeah, it was very funny because all the names of the beers were written in katakana and looked very nice. And all the people were eating the sausage. And was it authentic German beers they had at Oktoberfest? Mm, the, the beer, yeah. The beer was the real one. Mm -hmm. but, uh, maybe the sausage, maybe a smaller version, a Japanese kind of right. German sausage. But it was fun to see it, how they enjoy it. Yeah. Yeah. Were there many German people at the Yokama Oktoberfest? Mm, no, not so many. More Japanese people. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you're, I think, halfway through your stay in Japan this time? Yeah, right. I'm going back in August, the mm -hmm. end of August. Okay, so what plans do you have between now and August? Um, first of all, studying. Mm -hmm. But in uh, free time, I want to go to Osaka, mm -hmm. Kyoto, travel a little bit around and try to enjoy the summer mm -hmm. I have here. I hope it's not too hot. <laughs> right. Well, last summer was the hottest summer on record, yeah. so yeah, yeah, I hope we don't get hotter than that. Yeah. But might be nice, might be okay. I just want to experience what Japan has to offer. Okay, okay thanks for coming in. Yeah, thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.